Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going over how I built a SaaS in three days, got it viral on TikTok with millions of views, and then got a $120,000 investment offer from Techstars shortly after, and even a Y Combinator interview later on. All from this one thing that has been started. And because of that, I wanna start with a quote from the one and only Steve Jobs saying you can't connect the dots looking forward, you can only connect them looking backwards. So you have to trust that the dots will somehow connect in the future. And that is so true because this all started as like a like a night night project, right? Um, my friend and me uh, were sitting there and come up with the idea to uh, put ChatGPT into WhatsApp, right? Quite simple idea. At the time it was something very, very novel and um the building time wasn't really really much uh, in the beginning we did a lot of mistakes we used like third-party softwares like twilio to build this i would highly recommend you to not use any third-party softwares to build it um by the way if you if you want to clone this um quick plug here for my code template this is basically you you can clone this and build your own uh, whatsapp chatbot that you can monetize um on whatsapp with my template all right, let's get back to the video. Um, basically, we built the first version. I made a TikTok. This TikTok I made when I was at the airport waiting for a flight. And I was like, hmm, okay, how could we get users for this, right? Let me just let me just address a problem that people had at the time and uh, present a solution and say a call to action. And, it, and it, got, it just got viral, right? This is what can happen with TikTok account. My account had basically zero followers and this can just happen overnight so just put something out there uh yeah you never know what happens uh by the way if you want to know how i created these tiktoks i have like a free notion sheet um going over how i got 400,000 users for my ai SaaS, basically mostly with free tiktok videos yeah this is how how most of the nights looked at the time um crazy amount of traffic on the website like the feeling this rush of um, hundreds of people at the same time on your website trying to access your product, right? That That's how you know you you have like product market fit because um, at the time, as I said, our infrastructure was super, super garbage. Like we had like Twilio and whatever and they ripped us off with costs like Twilio charges you per, mes per message even though you can just access the WhatsApp API for free actually. Um, and yeah, we had to shut it down, had to put a wait list up for like two weeks, completely rebuild the whole infrastructure and so on, make it much more scalable and then let people back in from the wait list because there was just such a demand for the product. And there still is, right? Maybe not anymore for completely raw ChatGPT WhatsApp chatbots, but for chatbots that are a little bit uh, twisted, right? Like a different prompt. Um, maybe personalized chatbots to a business or to a to a person. There's just like endless ideas and opportunity out there. I can even make a video uh, about like ideas that I have for uh, for more WhatsApp chatbots. Yeah, what then happened is we actually got listed in one of the biggest German newspapers. I don't even know how the Germans uh, got uh, aware of this because everything what we did was in English. Um, I'm German, so um, I was happy about seeing that. And of course, my mom uh, was happy about seeing that because, yeah, moms, they don't really know what you do, right? Until a newspaper confirms what you do. And then they're like, oh, yeah, you actually do something, right? So, yeah, this is an insanely big newspaper, 16 million monthly visits. And after that, uh, I'm sure this number even increased uh, even more. And yeah, that was a great validation. This is the article that they that they said about us. It basically says in German how to how to launch a, a WhatsApp chatbot, um, AI chatbot. Yeah, just some some Stripe uh, screenshots of of uh, how like how how many customers just signed up. And um, over the time, I even I refined like the sign up process way 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 more. Like in the beginning. I basically just like let all the people free into WhatsApp. And then at some point I was like, oh, shouldn't we implement a paywall or something like that, right? So yeah, the process is now like way better. And yeah, then Techstars reached out. Techstars, if some of you don't know, is like the 
tier two accelerator after Y Combinator. Uh, they, they actually DM'd me um, yeah, out of the blue. I do, don't even know if I had Ginny in my LinkedIn bio. I probably posted on, on LinkedIn like once about it. Um, yeah, and then they DM me and like, hey, this looks cool. Uh, you want to chat basically, right? Uh, this was like the day that we chatted with them. It w was honestly just a very quick chat. And boom, yeah, after that, they immediately said, hey, we want to have you guys on. Um, we want to have you guys move to Berlin, uh, work with us and the Audi uh, program. So they always have like a, um, a, a big tech partner or a, a bank, for example, or some kind of company that supports the program and tech stars. Um, differently than Y Combinator is in multiple cities. Y YC, right, is just in San Francisco. These are multiple cities. And yeah, it, it sounded pretty cool. We debated for quite a long time if we should do it or not. Um, they give you $120,000 for 6% of your company. Um, however, there's a little bit of a twist. Uh, you actually just get $20,000 deposited into your bank account. And the other $100,000 um, are actually a loan that you get. So we found that out later. Um, so it's it's kind of a little bit of a shady thing. Like that means um, you end up probably giving them even more equity uh, later on. And also you are personally liable to pay back that loan. So we were like, we were like back and forth, like should we do it or not? And at the end decided... Um, we we just want to live from this cash flow right uh, because it was going really really good and um profit margins is like 95 percent right uh for for an ai app like this um another another thing is i looked up the um the past companies of of uh the techstars berlin program and i looked up like the past 250 companies okay and I also encourage you to do that. If you, if you, if you do that, like go through the accelerator, right? That, um, that you have an offer from and just like look them up. Like we would then check like Europe and then like, um, uh, and then like go through the, like the Berlin thing. And I was a bit shocked, like actually like none of the past 200 something companies in the, the Berlin accelerator like kind of made it, uh, you know, um, and even like some like two years, three years ago. And I was like, mm, I don't know, like seems like this is mm, maybe not the right opportunity. And if you look at YC companies, right, like most of them uh, raise like immediately after again, like six months after um, and like two years later, either they're dead, <laughs> of course, or they have lots of traction, right? So, um, yeah, I mean, Techstars also has some good companies like, like Chain Analysis, um, DigitalOcean, like for sure they have great unicorns that they funded, TradingView. But uh, yeah, in the end, we decided against it and said, okay, either go with the best, that is YC, right? Uh, or none and just bootstrap, just keep the company 100% to yourself. And yeah, that led me then to my second WhatsApp based company, actually. Um, Saturday AI, um, a B2B SaaS, also based on WhatsApp, AI appointment setter. And um, yeah, uh, mostly right now, I'm still sometimes building uh, B2C chatbots based on my, on my template, as I, as I say here, right? Uh, because I just love that. I just love that, that rush of B2C, right? Like when you have these big numbers and all these payments that you get, um, it's beautiful. Um, you don't really have that in B2B, like this going viral effect. Um, but yeah, it, it's good. And yes, that also led us to a Y Combinator interview uh, with this company because Y Combinator really loves like B2B stuff. And um, yeah, that is that is pretty amazing. Um, didn't get in this time, but got like amazing feedback from them. And we're gonna gonna keep reapplying. And they basically told us like, you're going to do very, very well. Um, they basically told us, we're not sure if you can make it to a billion dollar company, but you're going to do very well. I'm like, all right, that actually sounds really good. Um, so yeah, we're going to uh, keep building and keep uh, applying to that. And yeah, that's that's the whole story um, of how, how we built that, 
got a 120k investment and uh, yeah that is basically it thank you for for watching this video and uh if you wanna if you wanna exactly know how i built that uh you can watch the next video like right up here um i do like a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to build something like this and build it for different use cases uh different angles different niches i like i'm a s extremely big advocate of of whatsapp um, I think it has like amazing network effects. Um, if you acquire one user, they might share it to like a group and you acquire like 500 users just by them sharing your number to a group. So I really think it's like underlooked. And um, yeah, thanks for watching this and have a great rest of your week.